Three scary skeletons and shivers down your spine Hi, I'm Carola And I'm Grace Welcome to Fashion Week, we are in Milan Let's bring out our first look Beautiful! What are you wearing today? Angel Soft, two ply that's so beautiful. And great texture and detail. Mm -hmm. From she head to toe. Even at the crotch. Oh, nice boots. Thank you. I like this white color. It looks really great on you. How much did you pay for it? $12. That's nice. Thank you. That's a really good deal. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> no, I'm wrong. As the month of October is winding down and coming to an end, so is our football season. We may have had some ups and downs, but all in all, as long as we had fun, that's all that really matters. We would like to congratulate our science fair winners of 2016-2017 school year. 9th grade, Drew Waddle. 10th grade, Nathan Kidd. 11th grade, Cade Mead. And 12th grade, Shay Kidd. You all did a great job, and thank you for participating. The end of October also means the beginning of Halloween, so as you go out and celebrate Halloween however you plan to celebrate, be sure to keep your safety and the safety of others in mind and have a happy, happy Halloween. Haunted History on the Hill will be October 31st, Monday, and you can dress as any historical figure, and you will get a brown paper bag and get to go trick-or-treat at the end of the day to all your teachers, and you'll get bonus points from your social studies teachers. There will be a zombie run 5K in Pikeville Saturday, October 29th. The Coal Run Fire Department Haunted House is $3, and it's from 7 to 10 p.m. It's open every day but Sunday. The Bob Amos Haunted Trail is October 29th from 7 to 10 p.m. 
Fallsburg, um, $22 for tickets and $3 for parking. They're open October 28th and 29th, and tickets go on sale 30 minutes before dark. Jenny Wiley Boat Ride is 28th and 29th, that's $10, and they have hay rides. Trick or Treat in Pike and Foley County is October 31st from 6 to 8. And have a happy, happy Halloween. Amen. Amen.